Hi, it's Christy, and I am here with a very special Barbie box. I wonder how many of you have seen one of these kind of Barbies. I have had this for several years, waiting for a special time to use it, and I think this is the time. So, it was a gift given to me by my family because they knew I loved the, uh, the legacy of this particular woman and I had read her, um, the story of her life, her biography. And so for Christmas, they got me some special items to go with that book that I was reading. And I'm just gonna show you the top here. I have the disclaimer. I'm including one of these in all my shoe boxes because it would be very difficult for the people at the processing center to unpack and repack. So, um, if you want to print this out on blessingsintheshoebox.com, it's very easy to take this whole sheet. Uh, well, the whole sheet would be like this, cut it in half and then get two per sheet and put it in the top of your shoe box, especially if you make very full shoe boxes. All right, so in here, let me see if you can tell what kind of Barbie she is. Do you have a guess? I'm gonna go ahead and take out this green spiral notebook and put it aside. It is a special Barbie and I'm gonna take her out of the organza bag so you can see her really cool shoes. This was packed at the packing party, my last packing party. And I don't think that the, that the girl who packed this really knew who she was or anything. So I'm curious to know if you guys will know who she is. So here's, here she is. What do you think? Do you know who this is? See her cool shoes? She was the first um, Barbie that the, park, that the Packers grabbed. I think it's because she has a cool hat, she has her glasses, she has gloves, she has a coat. She's a really neat Barbie. And this is, for those of you who haven't guessed, Rosa Parks. So Rosa Parks was probably made famous when she wouldn't get off the, or wouldn't give up her seat on the bus to a white man. So this is her, she has a, an incredible legacy, and this is her shoebox. So I'm going to put that down here and show you everything else in the box. So she has one of these special headbands for the girl that will receive this shoe box. She probably won't know, but she will like this Barbie. I am, I've got so much good stuff in here, it's hard for me to choose. She has a soft heart. And this is another very special thing that I included in this shoe box. So I'm taking a couple of these bracelets work great as rubber bands. So I'm taking those off and I have, this is her fabric that goes with her sewing kit. So I'm gonna take that off and show you what's underneath. So this is her You Are My Sunshine music box and it really is nice. I wanted you to hear that it played the whole song and it doesn't take up very much room in a shoe box. I love including these music boxes and because of her testimony that she was really, um, a ray of sunshine in her time and she made a big difference in the world. I love the combination of the music box and the Rosa Parks Barbie. Um, here, I'm gonna just get this out of the way too. This is a really nice fabric piece that a girl will be able to enjoy sewing. She has a pair of cool sunglasses in here. They're a little bit mirrored and they're the aviator style. I love those. 
and she has her dancing ribbon wand which i include in all these older girl boxes i love the colors of this ribbon combination is really pretty and bright she has the the gold color in here which i love because of the you are my sunshine box and then she has the horses of organza bag with horses and a pretty beaded bracelet stretchy bracelet in here I love these stretchy bracelets with the little beads and then she has three horses she has this God is Emmanuel Psalm 145 bracelet she has um, a bag of an organza bag with three friendship bracelets she has a hacky sack and i do have to put a note on these hacky sacks that say that these beads are not organic material so these are really nice pellets in here not sand i have to make a little note for that if you do that for your um, shoe boxes if you include hacky sacks and then look at this i'm gonna get really close it is another rosa parks and she has a, the same outfit on. She's pre pretty famous for this. Um, a pic picture taking of her at this time and, and her clothes were very similar to the, this. So she has the little one and the big Rosa Parks in her same shoe box. She has um, a water bottle and let's see what's inside the water bottle. That this was packed at the packing party, so you don't know what exactly is going to be inside. She has the friendship bracelet kit, which is awesome. She has some bright yellow socks, which is fantastic. It goes with the sunshine. I didn't even pick those, but it goes with the sunshine box. She has a very soft plush heart. She has, oh, she has two more of these bracelets that i can put in her horse organza bag she has a spoon which i like to use for all these older girls and boys and she has a velvet scrunchie another bag of these are so nice because you can share the um, friendship bracelets she has another special thing in here the chapstick or the lip balm i guess that's a better thing to call it i think i've told this story before but there was one girl that went online and she uh, had received her shoe box and she was so disappointed because she didn't get any lip balm but her girlfriends did so i have been trying to include lip balm for my older girls boxes it must have been very important to her so other girls might feel the same uh, this is her little hygiene kit with the nail file and the nail clippers. Let's see what this is. This is a whistle. A whistle on the string is so wonderful to include for boys and girls. It's a nice safety, safety thing to have. And this is her, let me see, you can see that her cross, her wooden cross that she can slip in her pocket. This is her sewing kit. So inside this one, she has a pretty little, um, it's a sewing kit project. I had a couple of those left over that Michelle had sent me last year and I, I didn't re even know I had them. And then when I pulled, pulled some things out, I found one of these. So it's very, very, this is a very nice kit that she made me with the safety pins here her little sewing thread needles here, some buttons, the um, containers, uh, or what do you call these, bobbins, filled with white thread. And this is a measuring tape in here, needles, pins, and this other little pocket back here. Oh, so special. Thank you, Michelle, for making these. I'm glad I stumbled upon it so I could include it this year. Very, very special gift for a girl. And then she has one of these bags that fold up really, really small in a, sh a shoe box and it holds a lot of things. So I'm not gonna open that one. 
she has an orange bag for all of her menstrual pads one two three four five menstrual pads that Michelle made and here's the directions you can print those out off on blessingsandissuebox.com each one is different and look how nice and small they fold up it's very very soft she said um, one pad can hold over a full cup of water because it has a PLU liner. It does not leak. So making these is a very, very special gift for all of my older girls. She has one of these mirrors. It's an acrylic mirror and I'm trying to write on all of mine and I have to do it for this one because I'm going back. I, I have to go back to the ones that I packed to put it on there that says OCC approved acrylic so that nobody at the processing center will think these, this will be a glass um, item that needs to be thrown out. This is the what's called How to Play Cat's Cradle. Really special fun game that I played and my girls played growing up. I love including these and they're so nice and flat. At some point I need to count how many toys are in this box because it's got so many toys. Oh, here it is, like this. So somehow I got two of these mirrors in here so I can move this one out. And I put the disclaimer right there. And then this is the Tangram set that we've been making. Love these, not too hard to make, but I'm glad I made them earlier in the year. I have, these are her four or five pairs of really nice underwear in here. One, two, I think four, four pairs I've been putting in here. So I keep those in there, they're discreet. And here is her school supplies kit with all of her pencils, her sharpeners, erasers, scissors, colored pencils, coloring book, stickers. I love all of my, the fact that all of my shoe boxes have a full um, school supply set. And here's a lovely orange fan. It's so great and fun to include in the shoe box and it's flat, so flat and it fits great. I think it goes with the vintage look of the Rosa Parks Barbie. I love that. She has, I think this, yep, this is her older girls coloring book with the horses and all kinds of different images in there that are beautiful. Here is her very soft washcloth, her purple bandana, and her ruler, which we put in diagonally. So that brings us to the end of this box. I think it was very full and very fun to pack this box. And I'm especially pleased with the Rosa Park Barbie. She has joints that are, um, so she can move and bend in a different, more, um, she has different ways she can bend her knees and so forth that the regular Barbies don't have. So extra special, two Rosa Park dolls, little and big. I just love the shoe box with the You Are My Sunshine music box. And I'm very pleased to have the wonderful sunglasses and the delightful sewing kit. So thank you, Michelle, so much for being my partner in this work for the Lord, sending the gospel around the world to the children. May God bless you. Let me know in the comments below what special things you're sending in your shoe boxes. God bless you and bye for now.